Hello again, subscribers and to all the YouTubers. Yes, it's me again. I hope you're not sick of me yet. Um, I am doing a what's in my Target Hello Kitty trunk or aka Target Hello Kitty trunk um, because I got this Hello Kitty trunk from Target aka Target. Um, when I did my video on uh, my updated version of what's in my Hello Kitty room or half a room. Um, I showed you this trunk, right? But I didn't show you what's in it. That's because I just want to show you um, what's, you know, half of my room first or a little bit over half than my room first. So now that I did that video, I decided to show what's in here. And, and why the things are in here is in here. Because Remember when I mentioned to you that I put these items on the second shelf just in case if there's an earthquake? Well, okay, um, I don't live near a hill, but you know, but just but there is a hill near me, and I'm not sure. Well, I guess that's just me being paranoid. But you heard of stories like you know when people when there's a fire or anything like that and they have to you know like hurry up and evacuate or like they have only moments to pack their things and as you all know I don't think I have time to pack all these things with me right so anyways what I did was I put in a few of my Hello Kitty things in here and I know um I have my, like, my medical stuff, all the stuff, you know, like, medical and insurance stuff, that's already packed up in my Hello Kitty luggage. But this one is my favorite. Like, just in case if there is time, I have time to grab this trunk with me and go. You know what I mean? So here are some of the items that um, I either have extras of or um, that you haven't seen from my Hello Kitty um, half a room tour, almost half a room tour. So as you all know, I already love Hello Kitty Christmas. So I put one of my Hello favorite Hello Kitty plushes, and I have an extra, you know, Dodger um, plush. So I stuck that in here. And here's, at the, it was hard for me to find this. But that's why I put this in here, the Hello Kitty um, Pez dispenser. And then here is the Hello Kitty aromatherapy thingy. Um, I thought, just thought it was neat. So I put that in there. And then my plushes. I picked these three because I love pink. So I need to have one. And then this one is my first. Oops, sorry. My fingers got in the way. This is my first Hello Kitty plush. So of course I have to have that. And then the third one is because I love pastels also. So that's why this is in my, um, I guess my emergency emergency Hello Kitty items like if I only have you know moments to you know get out of my house to evacuate that that is what I would take with me um my lunch box or lunch pail and then I got these uh these in here. I I forgot what I oh I don't know what I have in here um Hello Kitty champagne glasses they're just delicate and so I put that in there and not only that, if there's an earthquake, you know, at least everything will be in here. And, like, these are my Hello Kitty, my favorite Hello Kitty mugs. And then I got this because that's my Hello Kitty 1988 calendar. So, got to have that. I think that's the oldest one I have. I'm not sure. And then, of course, my Senreal book. And then that's my other Hello Kitty book which is not part of the other book collection that I showed you earlier from my updated um, book shelves or Hello Kitty shelf. I can't even talk. So that is what I have in here and why I place it in here. Um, actually, I did have my Swarovskis in here, in here too, but it's just, you know... What if there's never going to be a fire or earthquake and it's just going to be in here all this time and I don't get to enjoy the view of it. So that's why I put it out on display. That's the only reason why. And as for the rest of it, you know, I already have, you know, 
plenty of Hello Kitty Christmas plushes and Dodger plushes. So that's why I put in here. These are just Hello Kitty posters. And then this is where I had my Swarovski item, but I just put the bag in here so I know where to find it. And then in here is just the little spoon and some pictures I took at Three Apples and some other stationery, Hello Kitty stationery. And speaking of Hello Kitty stationery, um, oh gosh, this one is just a scrapbook that I did um, because I had so much of Hello Kitty stationery that I decided to make a scrapbook of the little things from this one's from the 80s or early 70s I think it's just a Hello Kitty stationery thing but this is not part of my emergency thing if I would have to escape you know what I mean but this is just Hello Kitty stationery through the years I'm not sure if you're interested in looking at the whole thing, but um, but this is how it looks. And, oh, and this is my calendar collection, or Hello Kitty Sanrio Mate collection, like 1983. I didn't get all of them, you know, all throughout the years, but that's what whatever I have, I just placed it in here too. So, um, so that's basically it on my Hello Kitty scrapbook. Oh gosh. And this stuff is not Hello Kitty. This is just my fitness books and my um, fashion books, I guess you can call it. And um, more, more fitness and fashion books. Yeah, so that's what else I have in my Hello Kitty room. <laughs> um, trying to learn French, but it's really hard. Her. And then in here in this bag is um, my family photo album, just tons of photo albums, and that is part of my emergency uh, evacuation items, things. So that way, because you know, like I know I'm sounding paranoid now, but you know, when it comes when it's emergency, I tend to panic and. I don't know about everybody else, but for me, I know like when there's an emergency situation and then you have to evacuate and take all your things, you know, uh, for me, I know I won't be able to think. My, I'll be scatterbrained, you know what I mean? So at least this way, I know the things that I do want to take with me when, when like, you know, when, they, when you hear stories on the news like, oh, you only have a half hour to, you know, take your things, your personal items, gather your personal items. You know how they always say that you have a half hour to gather your personal belongings or whatever before you evacuate. So at least this way, I know I got this and then my photo album and then in the luggage I show you, my Hello Kitty luggage, but that is where I put like, you know, medical papers and insurance. So everything's in there too. And so if we have to have to evacuate, those would be the items I take with me. But then if there is time, then of course I'll come back for, you know, everything else. But, um, you know, clothes you can always get back. You know what I mean? Like, so that's why I don't, you know what I mean? Like, clothes, you know, like, whatever. But, you know, Hello Kitty items, they only make certain ones, you know, like after they make it an item, you don't see it anywhere anymore. So that is why I pack my Hello Kitty items. And um and I kinda have in mind like, you know, my certain my favorite Louis Vuitton bags too. You know, so but that's it I guess. <laughs> so anyways I hope you enjoyed this and I didn't bore you again. But so but anyhow just in case if you were all wondering what was in my Hello Kitty trunks, but that's what was in it, and why is the Hello Kitty things in there are in there, and um, that's basically it. And again, thank you again for watching. And um, oh, you know what? I just realized. Um, might as well show it to you now, because I think when I was showing you what's in my Hello Kitty room items, I forgot to show you like inside here. That's just my Hello Kitty Mac makeup bag. It didn't fit my drawer in there. Oh, the cup is covering it. There it is. So that's what's in here. So, okay, now I showed you everything, I hope. And...
that's just a juicer, Hello Kitty juicer. Okay, now I showed you all everything. And Hello Kitty Yogurt Land plushes. Okay, now I showed you all everything. So again, thank you for watching and um, have a wonderful day. Bye.